Hello and welcome to uh, C Sharp uh, using Unity. This is lesson six and this is on uh, increment and decrement operators. And these are pretty cool things to use. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that um, I come to my camera that I don't have any of my older scripts attached to it. So I'm going to click on it and remove the component. And then I'm going to go ahead and start a new script here. And I'm going to put create C sharp. And I'm going to call this uh, my uh, increment. Now these increment and decrement operators, oh, and don't forget, I need to attach it to the camera. Okay, and let's just open this up. We're going to be talking about increment and decrement operators, and they can be very useful in like keeping track of a player's health, like it could be incremented each uh, by one each time, or decremented by one each time because they're fighting. So what I want to do, I want to make a very simple integer, uh, x, okay, and have I'm going to initialize that to zero, and I just want to go ahead and print x to make sure that um, I have uh, everything's working. As a matter of fact, I'm going to uh, set that equal to a two, okay, and so I just should see a two on the output. All right, here we go. We save it and we come over here. And then we go whammo, and on the output, I see there's a 2, and that's exactly what I wanted. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in here, and I'm going to use what's called an increment operator. I'm going to go uh, print, and I'm going to print the value of x plus plus this time. You say, wow, that looks sort of weird. And then I'm going to print the value of x again, okay? So what I've done here is that I'm going to print the value of x, it should be 2, and then I said 2 plus plus, whatever that means, and then I'm going to uh, look at x again. So I said x plus plus, actually. All right, so I'm going to go here, and I'm going to close this down, and I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to run this, and I see there's the value of x, 2, there's the value of x plus plus, it's still 2, and there's the value of x again. Now it's been increased by 1 or incremented. And let's see what's going on here, what this means. What this plus plus means, it means increase the value of this variable by 1 after it's, um, after, uh, after this. In other words, the next time it's used, it's now going to be in, uh, incremented by a value of 1. So this is called a, a post increment. Okay, we're going to have a pre-increment, but this is a post-increment. Post means after. So after it's used again, uh, then it's going to be increased by one. Let's look at, so I can say in a comment here, this is a uh, post, I-N-C-R-E-M-E-N-T, okay, which I should have said before. All right, so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to do what's called a pre-increment. I'm going to put the plus plus before it and take it away from here. So this will now be a pre, P-R-E, a pre-increment. So I'm going to, this should be 2. Let's see what plus plus x is, and let's see what x is after that. So this is going to be my pre-increment. Let me close this, and let me go ahead and do this. And I get 2, 3, and 3. So pre-increment means incremented at the time that I say uh, the increment thingy, like for example, increment it right now. Okay, so if this were a player's health and they were resting, uh, and this was health here, and this was plus plus health, next time you use health, it would be incremented by one. Okay, now what we're going to look at, we've looked at the pre increment and post increment, we're going to look at the decrement operator, which is a minus minus. So this is going to be a post uh, decrement. This is the post decrement operator. So it starts out with 2. Let's see what happens at x minus minus, and then let's see what value is after that. Okay, this is the post decrement. So here I go, 
and I see there it is too. There's the post decrement, and now it's been decremented the next time it's used. Okay, so you might say, well, this is a pretty weird thing, but uh, as a programmer in C sharp, you should know what these things mean. Okay, so we come over here, and now we do a minus minus. Now this is a pre decrement, so I'm going to write it down here. Our e pre decrement. So we know this will be a two, right? The print x right here. Let's see what this is going to be and the following. I'm going to save it, come here, and then go ahead and run it. And now it's a two. Now it's a one, and it continues to be a one. So I see on the uh, pre-decrement operator, that means decrement it right now. Don't wait. And then, of course, it'll remain at its new value. So what we've looked at, we've looked at two kinds of operators. We looked at the decrement operator and the inc increment operator. And we've looked at two ways of using each one. Uh, we had one that was a post increment, and then we had a pre increment. And then for the other, we had a post decrement and a pre decrement. Okay, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching.